good times. There's going to be good times, good times. I know there's going to be... Panthers, I'm Jessica Villa reporting from Channel J106 for Prowler TV. We are having a coin drive that starts today through Friday. We are competing against each other, so don't forget to bring in your coins. The coin bins will be at the front during all lunches. Now here's Moses with the sports report. Thank you, Jessica. The varsity football team survives the first round of the playoffs to advance to play Houston Lamar in the area round. The game will be this Friday at 7 at Tully Stadium. Congrats to the girls volleyball team on an astounding season. They lost last Friday against George Ranch in a very close game. Anyone not in the boys soccer athletic periods who would like to try out for the soccer team needs to come sign up with Coach Keys in D125 before Thanksgiving break. Trials will take place after school November 28th, 29th, and 30th from 3 to 4.45. The boys' first basketball game will be tomorrow against Summer Creek at Summer Creek High School. Come out to watch them play. That's all for sports. Back to you, Jessica. Thanks, Moses. In academic news, the Fall Academic Excellence Ceremony is taking place on Wednesday, December the 8th at 6. The students to be honored have their names posted in the counselor's window. More information will come soon. The CCR Center will be taking a field trip to Texas A&M and Blank College on November 29th. This trip is open to seniors who have applied to A&M and Blinn or juniors who are interested in attending A&M or Blinn. You must turn in your permission slip by 3 on November 15th. Make sure you pick the permission slip up in the CCR Center. The United States Naval Academy will be in the CCR Center on November 28th. Sign up in Aviance. Remember if you are applying to Texas A&M or UT, transcript deadlines are on November 28th. Project Pink is having a stuffed animal toy drive for the Children's Pediatric Ward at Texas Children's Hospital. Because of the children's condition, we can only accept new toys. The drive is up until Friday, so please bring in your toys. Ariana had the opportunity to speak with Photo of the Week winners. Let's take a look. Hey guys, it's Ariana Flores reporting from Channel J106 for Prowler TV, and today I'm interviewing the Photo of the Week winners this week, Autumn Kirkman and Grace Mice. This is Grace. So what was the theme for this week's picture? The theme was um, Autumn and the rule, photo composition rule was rule of thirds. What inspired you to take that picture? Um, my sister's eyes matched the leaves that were on the floor by my house, so I had her hold them in front of her eyes, and yeah. You just took it? Yeah. <laughs> That's nice. How did you feel when you won photo of the week? Oh, I don't know, I was excited, I guess, because I thought I was gonna lose because I did such a basic picture, um, but then I won and I was pretty happy because I put so much time and effort, blood, sweat, and tears into that picture, man. <laughs> That's great. There we go. <laughs> well, that's all for today, Panthers. I'm Ariana Flores reporting from Channel J106 for Pally TV. Thanks, guys. Seniors, remember the deadline to submit in your senior quotes is December the 2nd. Well, that's all we have for today, Panthers. I'm Jessica Via reporting from Channel J106 for Prowler TV. Have a great day.